Okay, vocal check one, two, three. Uh, good morning, synchronous viewers. Welcome also to our asynchronous viewers watching later. And uh, this is going to cover the last part of what we're going to cover for this particular course today. Let's see, does this massy show? Okay, good. So today I'm going to give a little short little primer on how to go into the Network Academy and very efficiently pull up just these dozen videos that cover chapters 13 and 14, modules 13 and 14, which is the uh, uh, finishes covering all the material for this eight-week course. Uh, tomorrow at nine o'clock in the morning, I am going to turn on, I will activate the final exam. Cisco has it fixed at a maximum one-week period, so it'll turn on at 9 a.m. tomorrow morning, <clears throat> and it'll last until Wednesday, May the 12th at 9 a.m. in the morning. I, I have already went ahead in advance and recorded the the uh, instructor's lab demonstration lab on how to do password recovery and how to copy files with TFTP back and forth between devices. And so uh, since final exam week will start tomorrow morning, there will be no in-person lab uh, Thursday at nine o'clock and no more recordings uh, uh, need to be done because we're already recording everything. And then a week from today, Tuesday, will still be during the final exam period. That'll be the last day uh, before Wednesday when you can complete your final exam. And so there'll be no more live lectures either on that Tuesday. And then Wednesday, May the 12th at 9 a.m. in the morning is the final deadline for all work to be turned in. So in this particular course, it's consists of uh, the five uh, the five module exams that you take on netacad.com, the final exam, and those will add up and be averaged out to be 50% of your grade. And then the five labs are the remaining 50%. Uh, I do drop the lowest lab grade, so you can safely you can safely skip one lab. Uh, also, want to mention that um, the Cisco Network and Academy people have got this yearly event they do. This not only just for instructors, but this year they've opened this up a couple of courses to students, and there's going to be a live <clears throat> Cisco WebEx is is kind of like a uh, 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 it's like so, uh, Blackboard collaborated. It's like Zoom. It's an online video conferencing thing where you'll be able to see three former networking academy students who joined uh, Meraki and they became Meraki Network Engines. Now Meraki is a company that was bought by Cisco. They make some networking gear like Wi-Fi points. Uh, so that'll be, let's see, if it's uh, 12 p.m. Pacific, that means it's going to be 2 p.m. Thursday, this com coming Thursday, May the 6th, it'll be 2 p.m. in the afternoon. If you'd like to register for that link, click on that. It'll be similar uh, experience just when you you guys that went forward to the Cisco Career Bridge Fair thing that we had a couple weeks ago. <clears throat> okay, uh, what I'm going to do now is I'm going to jump over to netacad.com. I'm going to show you how you very efficiently use the sort function to find these 12 videos without having to look through all the different pages of the in online ebook. <clears throat> So let me see, I'm going to go to, I'm logged into Cisco Networking Academy as a student, as a test student account. So it'll look like what it looks like for you. And here's, here's our course right here. INSA, and I'll launch the course. <clears throat> and then we see the normal stuff here. I'm going to scroll down and I'm just going to open up uh, any of the module course content. It can be any one of them. It doesn't matter which one. I'll just click on one and open it. It's going to open up a new web browser. That's going to open up a new tab on your web browser. And uh, what I'm going to do is go up to the top here and click on this course index link, the middle link of these five links there at the top right here. I'm going to click on that. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to unclick all, and then I'm going to click on videos. And then I'm going to scroll down to the bottom to this last two modules. which are 13 network virtualization. And there's some videos there. And then network automation. And he has some videos there. So this way you can very rapidly zoom right to the videos. And if I wanted to watch this very first video, I would click on video. And uh, I don't know if video will actually play over, over our And you can go through and watch the video. I don't think the audio works through our Cisco Collaborate or WebEx um, Blackboard Collaborate. I don't think it picks up the audio properly. 
So that's how you do it. Click all those 12 uh, videos and watch those videos, and that'll pretty much completely cover everything that's in the last two modules, uh, modules 13 and modules 14. So, okay, guys, so that's about it. Uh, make sure your, your chapter module exams are in place. Take that course feedback form. You got to take that course feedback form and go back here and emphasize this. Oh, dear. Let me go back to here. Go back to here. Oh, yes. Um, the course feedback form, which is a student satisfaction survey, is required by Cisco before taking final exam in a particular course. It's anonymous. Nobody can see who you are. Uh, so you can do, uh, be as honest as you want to with your ratings. And, you know, Cisco, we've had 10 million students go through the Cisco Networking Academy. So they like to keep statistics of how they think they're doing. You have to complete that course feedback form. That's a business rule or business requirement on the Cisco Network and Academy website. You won't be able to take the final exam until you complete that course feedback form. And it takes about five or 10 minutes. It's going to ask you questions about how well do you think this course is preparing you to get your Cisco certification and go out and get a job in industry doing Cisco engineering technician type jobs, you know, those type of questions. Okay, so that's it. And I'm going to uh, go ahead and stop recording now. I think we've covered everything we need to. I'm gonna click here.